What's up guys, Boy Trainers back your video and this morning got some breaking news around 8 30, 9 o'clock this morning. Ole Miss basketball coach Kermit Davis and Ole Miss have agreed to part ways. Now this is not a shocker, this is not a surprise. And you know, Kermit Davis's first year at Ole Miss was actually his best year. The first year he was here, we went to the tournament. But now the last couple years we have got worse and worse and there's no signs of improvement many fans just like me are getting upset and just ready for a change and now that change it's official i will say i was a little shocked about the timing you know there's only three games left in the season i was kind of thinking okay kermit's on finish the year it's only three games left he's on finish the year and then once the season's over that is when the news is coming out and then that is when we will start looking for a new coach but you know, i hate he didn't work out for kermit i will say this for kermit super super nice guy his family really nice super nice family and you know wherever he goes to next um, head coach assistant coach you know whatever his future holds uh really do wish him the best of luck i really do but now talking about you know who's gonna be the next head coach at ole miss you know, Chris Beers, the guy that's been mentioned a lot the last couple of weeks, uh, former Texas coach. Um, he, he's definitely the one that's been kind of mentioned the most out of everybody else, for sure. There, there's always a chance, and I'll be the first one to admit it. I don't see this happening. But I will say there's, there's a small possibility it may happen. You, you just never know. There's always a chance you may call Coach Andy Kennedy back. Now, for those who don't know Coach AK, Coach AK was Ole Miss basketball coach for years. Um, but now he's at UAB. But there's always that small chance Ole Miss may call him back and see if he's interested. I don't see it happening, but I'm just throwing the idea out there. Just saying, you never know. If you go the route of a former assistant, Todd Apernathy, former Ole Miss assistant, now head coach at Florida Atlantic. That's always a possibility. I don't see Apernathy being our first choice. Uh, I think Chris Beard is definitely going to be pretty high on the list, if not our first choice. But if Chris Beard does not take the job, not interested, you know, you may hire someone. You know, one of these schools that made the tournament, goes on a run he may take a chance on a smaller team smaller coach not really quite well known may take a chance on one of those guys you know may call coach ak may call abernathy i mean you got a couple choices but it's on calm down to you know what does our athletic director keith carter think is best it's his choice it's his decision and i'm trusting in his arms um, uh, I know I've been kind of rambling on a bunch of random thoughts and random opinions there, but that's pretty much all I got. So, uh, if you could please leave a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already, would be appreciated. See y'all next video. Have a good one. Howdy, toddy.